days. So I thought I'd talk a bit about something that I noticed with just a little bit of the fandom. Um, now, obviously this is something I do kind of just a thought on from the outside, really, where I've seen some YouTubers, now I'm not saying any names because I don't really want to care, I don't really feel like stepping on anyone's toes, so I'm just going to keep names out of it. So, say you've got a YouTuber who has a furry YouTube channel, and they have their character, their sonar and all that, as their, you know, profile and all the rest, and they suddenly change it to their face, to their standard human, you know. How does that look for the outside of a YouTube channel for the audience? That's a question that I want you guys to answer. Does it alienate the audience? Because that's something that kind of I get the feeling of when you do something like that. It's not like I really care too much. It's just something that kind of gets me thinking. Um, obviously, when you have a furry channel, that's what your content is. So when you suddenly change your content or you suddenly do something different like that, it really actually does a lot of damage to the channel's viewing and also does a lot of damage to... A few other things. It's not so much the damaging physically, it's just it makes everything kind of it turns people away from wanting to watch. That's the best way of putting it. So say you got, you know, a channel that's based around reviewing, you know, movies or reviewing comic books or something basic, um, and you suddenly change that content, you're gonna obviously see a lot of your viewers that originally stuck around for that, you know, what you were first making, disappear. Either they just don't watch your content anymore, or they completely unsub and... Yeah, it's pretty simple things that when you do stuff, when you suddenly change your content type, it will completely flat down change your channel's analytics. I've seen it myself, because I've done it a few videos, I'll notice not so much interest through the videos that everyone likes, it gets the interest. So that's something that can obviously turn off viewers from when you're making channels, you know, videos. Just keep that in mind for everyone. Um, that's something I have noticed. Um, nothing really against it, it's just what it is. But um, yeah, and also when you are actually, you know, for a YouTuber, you'd think you'd have something that represents what your sona looks like. It isn't just your face. It kind of kills the point of that actually being the profile picture. Um, that's just a weird thing I can say. Um, honestly, I don't really have anything against these people or anyone really. It just it just seems odd from the outside, really. Um, from being a furry myself, I just, I, it just looks odd. Nothing against it, it's just kind of like, um, okay, just either this person just left the fandom or they just, why? What? What? Kind of makes me go, nah, I don't really know what's with this person, I'm kind of just confused. I'm just going to walk away while I can. I don't want anything to do with this kind of deal. That's how I feel about it emotionally. But maybe you guys have a different opinion on it. Let me know below. See you around.